y'all, what is up? It's Kimberly. For those of y'all that don't know me, I'm super excited about today's video because today I'm gonna talk about how I make a living. So I've been getting literally hundreds of questions this past week asking this and I'm so overwhelmed about it. I posted this TikTok right here. Can you say, see you next time? Yeah, so I know it's really cringy, but it has a lot of people asking me how I make money online and how I'm able to afford a lifestyle of traveling. So I have been able to create a lifestyle over these past two years that allows me to fully work from my computer, which means I can work from anywhere. I've been working from Bali and Mexico and the US and now I'm living here in Germany. So I have a lot of different income streams for to be exact right now. And the first two are underneath the same category, which is online teaching. And that is actually what today's video is going to be about. The third one is YouTube and the fourth one is freelance work. So for today's video, I'm going to talk about online English teaching. Online English teaching is a big component of how I'm able to make money online. And I teach for two companies, VIP Kit and GoGo Kit. Although there are two different companies and they do have a little bit of a different culture and they do things a bit differently, I think largely they are the same and do have the same requirements and pay. So I'm gonna basically talk about these two companies, generally speaking, but there are videos that you can find online really specifically about VIP Kit and GoGo Kit if you wanna know more about each company. I do recommend if you are doing this for a purpose like I am where I do really depend on this income right now, I do recommend at least having two companies so if you end up not liking one or one just falls through that you can have a backup plan. So let's go ahead and talk about requirements. This can be a little bit discouraging but there are so many other websites that you can check out that you might fit their requirements. but. For GoGo Kid and VIP Kid, you have to be either American or Canadian. They only want these type of accents. And number two is you do have to have a bachelor's degree. I've had a lot of people ask me that are in college if they can go ahead and apply, and the answer to that is no, they will not accept you because you do not have a bachelor's degree yet. But as soon as you graduate, that's definitely an option. Number three is you have to have a good webcam and headphones. I have a MacBook Air and uh, my web camera on my MacBook Air has been good enough. And number four, this is actually really important that I don't think enough people consider when they consider this job, is that you do have to like kids, even maybe love kids. I do like kids a lot, so it's made it a little bit less painless, especially if you don't like kids. I think that this job would be really, really hard and I wouldn't recommend it. So now we're gonna go into talking about the cons of this job. So depending on the hours, it can really suck. I'm here in Germany and the hours here are glorious. I work from around 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. on the weekdays and a little bit longer on the weekends. And Asia is a little bit later. I personally didn't like it because I was working until 9 or 10 p.m which I'm more of an early day person, so that was a little hard for me. And when I go to the United States, it's gonna be really, really early in the morning. I'm probably going to be working at 4 a.m., so if you're absolutely not a morning person and you're not able to just roll out of bed in 10 minutes and get perky, maybe this isn't for you if you're living in the United States. The next con is since there's so much pressure put on these children to speak another language, they can be really unfocused or really resentful and it's nothing to do with you but they're just really exhausted so just kind of having patience and understanding for that is really important because there are some of these kids that are wild. I've had kids like literally tell me that they hate me, stick the middle finger, walk away. I've had one kid shoot me with a fake gun. So that's things that you will notice. And also it's, yeah, it's just, you never know what to expect. And the Chinese culture is a lot different in terms of discipline, which is really hard for me to understand. 
Con number three is making a real full-time income is nearly impossible. I definitely would be making a lot more money if I was working for corporate America, but the pros of this job and the flexibility that this job offers definitely is worth it for me. But if you're expecting to be a baller with this job, don't, I don't recommend it. I mean, I just, people ask me how I'm able to afford it while I travel and I've traveled to countries that are a lot cheaper than the United States and I make it sustainable. I don't have a car payment. I don't have rent payments really. So you gotta work with it. All right, now that we talked about all of the negatives and the cons, let's talk about the pros because there's definitely a lot more pros than cons in my opinion. So number one is that it's completely flexible. You get to choose your own schedule. And this is really important for me because I prioritize my YouTube channel over teaching because this is what I want to grow long term wise. So if you're not subscribed to me, definitely subscribe to me. It would really mean a lot to me. And it is awesome because you can work whenever you want. You are completely in control of your schedule, which means you're in control of your finances. So if you want to work more on the weekends, you can really like cram it all on the weekends and not work during the weekdays, which is fantastic. Number two, and this is the part that I absolutely adore, is that you get to connect with children and with families internationally. Really random story, but I had a student today that was living in Germany and she speaks German, Chinese, and English. So you actually get to meet students from all over the world, not just China, but also it's really cool to know more about Chinese culture. I definitely never knew so much about Chinese culture until I had this job. It's really interesting and I would just absolutely love to actually meet up with one of my students one day. So pro number three is that you're teaching students a really invaluable skill and that's learning English. Since English is such an international language, it's really important to know and it really will change their lives. So anytime I find myself complaining about the job, I really try to remind myself that they are learning something that they'll be able to like literally remember the time in VIP kit or go go kit and how impactful it was for their lives. So always have vision behind why you're doing things. It makes things a lot better. Number four, the pay is pretty good. It's around 20 to 24 US dollars an hour, which is great, especially if you're like me and you're traveling around the world. That wage is way higher than wages in places that I'm living. So I'm even able to invest in a savings account. So I'm really happy with the pay. And last but not least, you get to take it pretty much anywhere. So if you're on vacation, or you're traveling, wherever you are, you can take it. And I really like having that security of knowing I can take my job anywhere I want. As long as you have a good internet connection, be careful in Mexico and Asia is all I'm gonna say. So I think that this job is perfect for a few groups of people. Number one, if you are a teacher wanting to increase your salary and you wanna get extra money on the side, if you're a stay at home mom, I think it's great for you so you can stay at home with your kid and teach on the line. And also maybe if you're in a really hard transition right now and you don't have a job but you have a bachelor's degree, I think this is a great way to make an income and to really soothe your mind with having less financial distress. And last but not least, I think it's perfect for people like me that are young and that really wanna go all in with their side hustles. It's just been a blessing, honestly. This job is incredible and it allows me to live the lifestyle I want. So let's wrap this all up. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave the links down below where you can apply for this job if you're interested. If you do apply with these links, I will get notified. So that way I can help you during the interview process and hopefully we can get you hired. And I'm also going to go ahead and leave a link down below for a blog post I wrote about GoGo Kid. It does really help out too if you're interested with VIP Kid. They're very similar. And if you guys want to connect and if you have any questions, definitely follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is at Kim Crosses Borders. Thanks for watching, y'all. If y'all enjoyed this video, please remember to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I will see y'all next week. Bye.